Hello everybody and welcome back to our channel. So finally I have the time to make some video for YouTube. This is because I make a lot of work on my batteries which they are taking me a lot of time. And for this reason sometimes it's really hard to make some work for the YouTube and my work at the same time. But I hope that this will change in the future. Because I have a lot of projects for YouTube and also for my Patreon. And yeah, I will make my best to make all these videos. But now, this video will be about this 3D printed water generator. So actually, this video was some request from people which they want to know how to assemble this kind of water generator. So this piece is actually the frame of this water generator. And... This one is the base which actually hold the left and the right frame in place. Like so. Really nice. So here I have the left frame and here I have the right frame. And you can see that this right frame is a little bit different like this one. And this is because here on this part you will put some coil, like so. But instead of using this frame, which you can put only one coil or maximum two coils, you can also use this frame and with this frame you will be able to put six coils. But the coils which you will put on this frame will be some custom made. Because here I have some, how to say, some coil holders. And you will make some winding around these uh, coil holders. Like so, for example. Okay, so like I said, this is the frame of the water generator, also this one with a little bit different uh, coil setup. And here I have the rotor, it's actually the water turbine. And this part is this magnet holder, because here in these holes you will put this magnets and the size of the magnets which I use are 25 millimeters and the height of the magnets is 5 millimeters so 25 and 5 millimeters for the height Now I put north, south, north, south, north, south. And that's it. And this magnet holder you will put on this water turbine, like so. And in the end, we have also this axis.
when you use this kind of frame then you make sure that you will use also this spacer over here only when you use this frame It's also really great if you will glue these frames on this base. But in my case, I will use this double side sticky tape, which also make makes really nice job. Really nice. Here I have some LED. That's it for now and we see us in the next video. Bye.